As part of the council's plan to cushion the effect of hardship occasioned by the first subsidy removal policy, the authorities of Kokaguda Local Council Development Area, recently led by Al Razak Olamilikon, provide soccer for about 2,000 households. The distribution exercise was done in the presence of the management team, council officials, residents, as well as representatives of Khan and the League of Imams. According to the chairman, Razak Olamilekon said the food palliative programs is part of the council's drive to alleviate the suffering of the masses. He noted that the food supplies will go a long way in providing relief to the indigents. We are providing palliative and our palliative today is to ease the stress of hunger in our local governments today. Uh, today's palliative is going to be stage by stage. This is going to be a fourth batch for us and we have a particular number that we are putting house to the public. The chairman alongside other dignitaries presented the food items to the aged, people with disability representatives as well as other community members. <laughs> The chairman in an interview said the exercise is in stages, adding that anyone that doesn't benefit from the first phase will benefit from other phases. Because we have seven world in our local government, we have called them out, called the Africans, called the disabled, called the, the women, the pastor, the Afar, everybody, the youth, everybody general in the community. We call them to be presenting their palliative, and this is what we have as a batch by batch that we are going to spread. We know today it can be everybody, but with the plan we have, it's going to go around. Currently, from this current gesture, two thousand our plan is for over two thousand households in the country to benefit. So we are targeting vulnerable, um, disabled, um, also the like the indigent people in our community, people that can not necessarily go outside to work or uh, in the Nigerians have to go and hustle. So currently that is those are the people that we are targeting, the aged, indigent and disabled. So, As it is now, every family that carries a package is automatically fed for about two weeks. So that's why we started with this. And also know that this is first batch. We are doing about six or uh, as many batches, but we are sure of five now, five batches. So if we have captured over 2,000, what we have done is about 2,100. If we have captured about 2,100 right now, just multiply that. And then we also hear that federal government has given has released some money. By the time we add that to what we are doing, let's assume we do about 2,100 now. You know, by next time, we are going to be doing almost like four or 5,000. By the time we do 5,000, like two, three times, you know, almost, we have covered almost everybody. Beneficiaries appreciated the council leadership over the intervention. We are really appreciate the council leader for what he has been doing in Abuja and the environment and that they should continue because you can see the amount of people that were here that they should do more. The Razak Olamilekon led administration in Kokaguda LCD has no doubt improved the livelihood of inhabitants. <laughs>